I thought we'd run over to that new restaurant by Bin County. <laughs> Okay, what's the joke? What do you mean? I don't know how you rigged it, but I'm sure that car's a real cut-up when a convention comes to what town. What in the name if of... If I Pep wanted a trick car, I would have bought one in a joke shop. Allow me to say that I haven't the slightest idea what you're talking about. You come blithering up in that beastly little car and assault my personal Rolls Royce. I brought it back. I want my money, I want the papers I signed, and then I'll get out of here and you two clowns can, can have your little laugh. Peter, Peter, Peter. Mr. Douglas, if there is anything wrong with the car, would you be good enough to tell me what it is? Well, there's nothing essentially wrong with the car. It's just that it wants to go one way and I'd like to go the other. Well, whatever it is, none of it is covered in our guilt edge guarantee. That oh, I can oh, tell oh, you. I'm sure of that. If you uh -huh. examine paragraph 12. Excuse me, Mr. Uh -huh. Thornite, but uh, I, if I sell this gentleman the car, I feel a certain responsibility. Do you mind if I try it? <laughs> Miss Bennett. Our dinner. Engagement. I won't be a minute. Seems to be acting all right now. Sometimes new car owners have a tendency to exaggerate their problems. We get that all the time. Believe me, when I was in this car alone, it was... Just treat it gently at first. It really is quite a fine little automobile. <laughs> have you had much experience with cars? Look, lady, by profession, I'm a racing driver. Oh, that Jim Douglas. What do you mean, that Jim Douglas? Let's see. Two years ago at Laguna Seca, you spun out and hung a beautiful Buick Special on the back fence. At Willow Springs, was it a year ago, last February, you sprayed a lotus all over the infield. How do you know all that? I have trouble with names and faces, but I never forget a car. I like good machinery. Now, why don't you give this little car a fair chance? You bought it. Enjoy it. You can drive me back now. What about it, Dad? Want to give that doodle bug a workout? I'll go easy on you. Be serious, will you? see this thing take off? One of your showboat tricks, Mr. Douglas. I tell you, I had nothing to do with it. Hey, we were turning. Out of sight, man. I wouldn't have believed it. Groovy, Pop. Groovy. Well, as long as the customer finally seems pleased, I'll just step out and find myself a taxi. Will you stop the car, please? I'm trying. It's just like I told you, this thing's starting to act up again. Now, very You want something or don't you? Help! Uh, two hamburgers and a coffee. Help! Can you help me, please? Help! I'm a prisoner! I can't get out! We all prisoners, Chicky Baby. We all locked in. Mm. 
A couple of weirdos, Guinevere. What? Wait a minute now. Well, hold it, hold it. Let me let me open the door. Hey, the door. knock it off, will you, sis? I ain't saying this is the classiest joint in town, but we gotta draw the line somewhere. Come on, back in your seat. Why don't you go up to Seabreeze Point? Fuzz don't bother you much up there. Thanks. 